Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's finally here, guys. Here Comes the Pain was finished. We did two seasons of it with Randy Orton and Rey Mysterio, and now we are on to the new uh, old retro WWE SmackDown game. Shut your mouth. We're doing a season mode, and we're going to go straight through it, starting right now. I know you guys really enjoyed the Here Comes the Pain series, and now, due to request, I'm bringing you uh, this season mode of Shut Your Mouth. And probably next year, uh, I'll do a different game, and so on and so forth. This season, we're going to do a totally new guy. We're going to do Eddie Guerrero. Um, he should be an awesome guy to use, and uh, it'll be a lot of fun. Uh, I do know in this game they have like the draft and all that sort of thing, uh, so it should be pretty fun to do to you know have that in there and do all. Oh look, we good evening, says Linda McMahon. Tonight we will witness the first ever World Wrestling Entertainment draft. Vince McMahon will represent That's SmackDown exciting. and Ric Flair will represent Raw. Re represent Raw. Um, both Mr. Flair Tonight, and Mr. McMahon, by Mr. McMahon and Mr. Flair will change the superstar's life. Will take turns on. picking superstars for their respective brand. The entire roster will be available for selection during the draft. In the interest of time, only 20 picks will actually be made live tonight. The lottery will be held immediately after the roster to determine the placement of the rest of this, the roster. Blah, 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 blah. If you would like to skip the initial draft, press the circle button at the top 10 draft selection screen. The undisputed champion of uh, whatever. We don't. You guys get all this. Um, Raw. We're going to choose Raw because. Um, what what uh, we did we were on smack we were on smackdown last time with Rey Mysterio so this time we're gonna go on Raw uh, yes I'm sure uh, and now we're gonna do some drafting uh, you know just to be awesome so uh, I guess we get to do some do some drafting now since I Vince, Mc, Vince McMahon defeated Ric Flair in the Toyn Cross uh, all right he's choosing he's going he's he's representing smackdown isn't he who's he choosing is he going for who is he going for the Rock Holy shit, he just chose the rock. Okay, well Ricky Flair is going for someone. Oh, so much better. Uh, actually, I don't know. Uh, pick a man who is the cornerstone. Uh, my number one draft pick is... Uh, who's the cornerstone? You'd say Chris Jericho, but he, he isn't. He wasn't at this point. Uh, we'll go with... Uh, we'll go with... Um, Oh, I don't know. I'm not sure at the moment. Uh, I'll tell you what. We will do Kurt Angle. Yes, go with it. Kurt Angle. Oh my God! Ric Flair just chose Kurt Angle. Holy shit! Uh, anyway, Vince McMahon gets to choose now. And for my second pick, I choose. What's he choose? Brock Lesnar. Oh my goodness! Who would have thought? He looks happy. He looks happy to go to SmackDown. <laughs> Alright, here's the Nature Boy's turn. Uh, his next pick is going to be me, Eddie Guerrero. Viva la raza, motherfuckers! <laughs> Eddie Guerrero! Oh yes, wonderful choice. Alright, we'll do one more pick. And then uh, we'll skip uh, the rest of them because we don't really care that much. Okay, his his pick is his pick is on behalf of SmackDown. He chooses dot 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 himself or or Rob Van Dam. I was actually gonna pick him then. Oh, he looks upset. What? <laughs> well, Rob Van Dam's going to SmackDown. Uh, we will do, uh, since I'm a huge fan of this guy, uh, and I think he's absolutely awesome, we're gonna go with the Y2J, Chris Jericho, and my little sister here is just here to say hello and good night. Are you gonna say hello? Hello. This is Freya, I know you guys can't see her, but she's, uh, she's six years old, she's my little sister, and she's just walking. You going to bed now? Alright, here we go, guys. Simulate the rest of the draft. Oh, and uh, Raw ends up with Kurt Angle, Eddie Guerrero, Chris Jericho, Lance Storm, Chris Benoit, uh, The Big Show, Rhino, Goldust, Billy Kidman, I'm guessing, and Bubba Ray Dudley. Uh, on SmackDown, we have The Rock, Brock Lesnar, Rob Van Dam, Booker T, Kane, William Regal, Edge, Jeff Hardy, Test, and Rikishi. Just for what it's worth, uh, put down in the comment section which roster there is better. Uh, anyway, we'll continue. 
Um, and uh, of course, guys, a reminder: uh, this Saturday, um, we have the first Q and A with me and Harold, or oh, with Zodak. It's going to be awesome. I I need. I really would love for you get the guys to you know go ahead and leave a question on any video, including this one, and we will answer it. Um, yeah, so it'll be awesome. Anyway, uh, we're starting off the show now. We're play We're fighting against Matt Hardy for the first week. Should be pretty interesting. Uh, but right now, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, shut my door. I miss him up. And we promise to bring you that new thrill and excitement straight to your television sets. I'm guessing he was just talking about uh, Monday Night Raw and the after the draft and everything. Oh, here's Ric Flair speaking to Eddie Guerrero. Oh, shit. You know, when I was the champ, I had to travel some rough roads back in my day. But at the same time, I was able to accomplish my dreams and the dreams of many fans out there. I believe that you have that same vision. I'm expecting you to do well on Raw, alright? Woo! <laughs> That's awesome. Woo! I think we've got to get in the chops now. Just just to tribute to Ric Flair. The nature boy. Alright, uh, just for this episode, since uh, we're running out of time, we've only got nine minutes left, uh, we're going to go ahead and go straight into the match. Uh, next time, if you guys want, I'll go and have a look, little look around. Uh, we're going to skip this match, because of course that doesn't interest us at all. Uh, Rhino gets the victory over Billy Kidman. And now we've got the match. Eddie Guerrero, Matt Hardy, this is going to be freaking crazy guys, the first week of April, the first episode of Shut Your Mouth, let's get it going guys. Brock Lesnar, Latino, Latino Heat, oh yeah, there he is. There he is, guys, Eddie Guerrero. I'm going to leave in the entrances as I, did, as I did with Here It Comes the Pain because that's what you guys wanted to do. So I'm going to carry on with that. Uh, hopefully, uh, we're going to go pretty far with this and it'll be a really awesome, 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 awesome um, season mode we have. I'm facing off against one of the Hardy Boys in Matt Hardy. Look at that. Very nice. Look at him, Matt Hardy. Don't worry, Hardy. You may you may be coming down to have a singles match with Eddie Guerrero, but you're gonna get your ass kicked. Oh, dear me. Oh, just a reminder, guys. Uh, tomorrow is the lockdown pay per view for my TNA Universe Mode series. Make sure you go and check that out. Um, and of course, uh, after that, I'm, uh, you're gonna have to let me know what rivalry you want to see happen uh, in the next uh, four episodes, four or five episodes. Um, Cause that's the way it works. You guys choose the choose rivalry, and I play it out. Uh, and it'll be awesome, man. Matt Hardy's got a great start. Oh shit! Oh, I just hit the ref. Oh crap! Matt Hardy is absolutely dominating right now. What? Why am I focusing on him? No, stop it! No, there we go. Hey, Ric Flair shot. Oh, here we go. Here we go. This is it. This, we're getting started now. Oh, tilt a wheel backbreaker. Hell yeah! I love those moves. If you guys didn't already know, I absolutely love it. Oh, what's this? Holy shit. Spinning. Oh, neck breaker. That's so awesome. I love that move. That is absolutely epic. Oh, an arm drag. Into the arm breaker. Oh, shit. Tap out, Hardy. Tap out. Oh, I didn't think he would, but anyway. Uh, elbow drop that kind of missed, but didn't really. Oh, and he's down. Uh, let's see what happens here. Oh, oh, shit. Roll up. Ah, oh, it's a rope break. Damn it. Oh shit! Oh! Sleeper slam, I think. Right? Hey! Sit down! Alright, suplex. Yes, here we go. Brain Buster! Holy shit! That was epic! Oh, what's this? Roll up! Ah, oh, it's a rope break. Damn it. Oh shit, I missed, I missed it. Oh, not with that though. Oh, that was cool. Get a party. Oh, shit. No, I didn't mean to do that, but whatever. Right. 
Elbow drop. Oh, there we go. Oh shit. Oh, some uh, nifty cruiserweight moves here. Getting, getting all in. Beating the crap out of Hardy. Doesn't even matter. Doesn't even matter. What the hell has happened? Oh, suplex. Oh, lovely. look at that. Beautiful. Oh, I missed, but whatever. Oh shit, you reversed. Oh man. Oh, let's get you up, man. I, I have no time for shit like that. No time. So here comes the Hurricane Runner. Oh yes. That's all she wrote, guys. That is all she wrote. Just for what it's worth. We're gonna do some crazy ass shit right now. Going crazy. What's this? What's this? Tornado DDT. Oh! Sweet! Oh, I didn't even know I could do that, but that is awesome. I guess I can't anymore, but whatever. Uh, I, what? Why isn't it doing anything? That's so dumb. Right, let's do this. Let's go for a triple one of these. This, this is going to be our new combo. Forget the three amigos. Forget all of that. We're going triple, um, triple airplane neck breaker. That's what it is. That's where it's at, guys. Triple airplane neck breaker. Uh, maybe we'll create a hashtag, a trend of that. That will be pretty cool. Alright, there we go. Matt Hardy's down and out. Ready for the finisher. Just going to end his, his game. Here we go. Five star. Well, not five star, but the frog splash. Two. Three. Earl Hebner counts the pin. And Eddie Guerrero gets the victory in the first episode of SmackDown. Shut your mouth. Hell yeah, that was freaking awesome. Alright. Look at that. We got the victory. Awesome. Absolutely awesome. Uh, I guess we'll f find... Oh, no, we won't. There's Hulk Hogan, the Unlockables. If you want to find out more about the Unlockables, visit the Shop Zone merchandise stand in the lobby of the arena. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, says Ric Flair, the Raw franchise prepared to sign the free agent Stone Cold Steve Austin. Oh, he's... Is he joining Raw? Oh, there's Vince McMahon. I'll tell you something. He wants an owner with leadership and management skills. Like you, Billy Mac. Stone Cold Steve Austin will sign the contract to be exclusively on SmackDown. Uh-uh. Oh shit, what? 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 <laughs> oh man, here comes Stone Cold. Reliving the actual scene that happened on Monday Night Raw. One time. <laughs> I say no to him and yes to you, huh? Uh, well, I read that already. You want me to sign your contract? What? What? You too, huh? What? What? <laughs> Seriously, what? I was interested in both and I thought about it a lot. I have made up my mind. The deal is done. Uh oh. Oh, he's shaking Vinny Mac's hand. Oh my goodness, it looks to me like he's joining Raw. Oh, SmackDown even. You know what? Oh. <laughs> Stone Cold Stunner! Holy shit, he just stunned the, the boss. He just Stone Cold Stunned Vince McMahon. Oh! And he Stone Cold Stunned Ric Flair and then signed the Raw contract. Ric Flair now owns Stone Cold Steve Austin, and he is now a part of Raw. What the hell is going on there? Chris Jericho wins the tag team match in the main event against Devon and Big Show. And that is all we have for tonight, guys. Hope you all enjoyed this episode. Remember to tune in tomorrow for the Lockdown pay-per-view, and uh, tune in every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday for SmackDown Shut Your Mouth. But for now, guys, leave a like if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment on whatever. Subscribe for more, and I'll see you all in the next episode.